there was a pigeon in the for, for a second. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Kim Wilpon Crafts. Hi, how's it going? I don't know, I gave you a thumbs up. But... So on today's episode, we will be discussing my beautiful, beautiful Lobelia cardigan. It's so luxurious and beautiful. I'm obsessed with it, completely obsessed with it. So in the beginning of March, I decided that I wanted to embark on a year where every month I will finish a sweater or cardigan, a garment. We're gonna finish a garment, one garment every month this year for the next year. So March 2022, this will end. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'll just continue making garments once a month for the rest of my life. I don't know. So hopefully we can really uphold this goal. If not, this is gonna be one wild ride adventure. So today we'll be talking about my beautiful, beautiful Lobelia. So the Lobelia is from Pom Pom Magazine. The 2013 spring issue. Yes, it is 2021. Um, it took me a really long time to get to this pattern. I found the pattern in 2013 and I purchased the yarn in 2017. I really loved this pattern. I loved how delicate it was and I could wear it with some high-waisted skirts. It gave me that kind of vintage-y, mo like modern vintage vibe, which I love so much. I finished this sweater and I was like, I am so beautiful. I, am. I feel like a pretty, pretty princess in this sweater. So the Lobelia was featured in the Pom Pom Magazine 2013 spring issue and it is by Megan Fernandez. It is a lace weight, requires a lace weight yarn and seven buttons. It was knitted with the The Artisan Yarns Align from the Hampton Hills Alpaca in Colorway Lobster Bisque. It is an alpaca silk lace, 70% baby alpaca, 30% silk. It is 875 yards. So to me, this doesn't say lobster bisque, though lobster bisque, I see it now. But I had been looking for what I call a ballet pink for like the longest time. I had been looking, since I saw this in 2013, I had been looking for this lace, soft, ballet pink yarn, and I couldn't find it anywhere. I went to like every knitting shop in the city, uh, nowhere to be found, and then in 2017, I went to Rhinebeck, and I saw the skin of yarn, and I was like, oh my gosh, that's the color. Is it lace weight? Yes, oh my gosh. And I almost didn't buy it, and my mom, when I told her I was making this video, she said, you have to tell everyone that I told you that you needed to buy that yarn. So thank you, mom. And shout out to my mom, Beverly. Hey, mom. Hey, Bev. What's up? Thank you, mom, so much for making me buy this yarn because it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect. But I wanted this to be done for April and May and, and just to feel my like princess fantasy which I clearly am feeling right now. Also, these buttons, I'll do a little, I'll walk, I'll walk a little in. But these buttons I got from a local fabric shop near me. So when I was in the fabric shop, I said, hi, do you have buttons? And she said, let me show you our buttons. If you can't find what you like there, then I'll take you um, to our other button selections. I found these and I was like, that's it, we're done so easy then I finished it up it was everything I ever wanted and I'm so glad to have completed this beautiful cardigan with all of its details I'll just show you a little closer I love all the details of the cables that we have and the ribbing and I love the raglan it has this beautiful floral pattern this beautiful lace detail it's really just incredible I just really want you to be able to see how gorgeous it is. So this is my Lobelia. I am so glad that I have finished this cardigan and I can now wear it as much as I want uh, in the upcoming spring months. 
Thank you all so much for watching today's episode. If you enjoyed it today, please subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. Ding that bell for those notifications and I will see you all next week. Bye!